This is Jordan Tower with JT News. Make sure you smash that like button, smash that subscribe, and let's get right into the news. Um, all right, so T.I. has responded, and Boosie gave a little bit more information on this T.I. snitching thing. T.I., let's first get to T.I., where he's bugging. He did a whole album with Boosie. He's been working on a TV show. He, know how, he knows how Boosie felt about that. And still, he came out with that. Now, supposedly, this is an old interview. I don't know if it's that old. Uh, I, I, I saw Vlad say it was older and that somebody, like, re-brought it back. But I don't know. This would have kind of gone viral a while ago when 50 Cent and him were going back and forth. But um, anyways... Boosie's like hurt by this because he's like, yo, we had such a good album and everything. And then T.I. is like, why didn't he call my phone and ask me about it? Because he feels betrayed, bro. You guys just did a whole album together. He wasted his time. He did a TV show with you. And now he can't stand next to you because you know how he feels about people snitching and stuff. He's not going to work with them. And T.I. had a pro has a problem with people snitching, too. He kicked Alpha Mega out of uh, Grand Hustle. Because he allegedly snitched with paperwork, right? T.I.'s kick people out for snitching. T.I. doesn't like people snitching, but then it's okay for him to snitch on his cousin. Pretty soon he'll admit to doing something with the whole Fed case with the guns. I mean, who knows? Maybe he was a confidential informant that we don't know about. I don't know. But this is weird how T.I.'s like, oh, it was a kerfuffle. It was a... He has a Someone was like, oh, you know, was, you know, people were the guy interviewing T.I. was like, oh, you have people cloud chasing and da -da -da. nobody's cloud chasing. This was public. And and yeah, Boosie didn't call T.I. probably because he was hurt by that. He was like, damn, I don't how do you even bring that up to somebody like, yo, were you snitching? Probably doesn't want to give him an a re, you know, a way to try to explain his try to explain his way out because like Boosie might feel like, oh, now I got to do this album with him because that's my dog, you know, but like he'd rather just keep his distance, I guess, you know, and I can't blame him. I can't blame him because that's how he feels about these situations. He's he's been to jail for a long time before, you know, so he has been to jail, too, but I'm just saying like. Boosie's been to jail for almost, he almost had life or something, right? He was on death row at one point, right? Um, He beat that and came home. He he stands on this. People wouldn't, he feels like people wouldn't respect him the same. And I understand that. So he's like, nah, I can't speak to him no more. Like, it's just you know, until I, you know, figure this out. He really believes that T.I. is lying, though. He's giving her an out. An out. T.I. doesn't realize they all he had to do was say, yeah, I'm lying about it. Like, I didn't really do that. I was just playing with people on the podcast, you know? If he said that, Boosie and him would be able to drop the album, do all this other stuff. Play the game, T.I. You played the game and everything else, you know? Like, I don't understand. Calling it a kerfuffle. Weird guy. Anyways, we'll get back into this. The minute is Jordan Tau with JT News. Smash that like button. Smash that subscribe. And I'll check you guys next one. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you. Peace.